A big hello from me, welcome back to Paul Rolls Dice and welcome back to my next Star Wars Rivals video. Now, first video, we took a look at the core set, the premium set. We're gonna move this out of the way because we also picked up two of the expansion sets. Now, the cool thing about these is if you don't want to spend the money on the core set for the premium characters, you can actually go in blind buy a booster box for both the light and the dark, mash them together, and there you have a full game. So, that's really interesting. Let's take a look. Should we go with, uh, what should we do? We'll do a light side. Okay, so we've got Obi-Wan and Ahsoka on the front. I'm pretty sure this is a blind box. So yeah, because there's two back of there, so we'll see anyway. Uh, fingers crossed for some good pulls. Um, so that's the kind of stuff you get in this. It's a little, a little box. What do we get? Uh, one character card, one character mover, which is the uh, the figure. Two character tokens, five action cards, two locations, so that adds to the nice amount that we've already got with the core set. Um, a die, six influence, lost tokens, three location markers, high ground marker, and instructions. Now, who can we get? We've got some nice characters. If I'm honest, I really want Ahsoka or Yoda. Those are the two. But I mean, if we've got General Kenobi, cool. But you know, we're new to the game, whoever. Let's have it. Let's have it. Who have we got? We will bust them all open. Let's get the cards out of the way first and we'll do the figure last. We've got Ray. Okay, we have got Ray, not Skywalker. Skywalker, whatever, whatever you want to call her. Uh, right, okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Right, let's bust it open. Ugh, let me get it open, bow me a sec. There we go. Use the old, uh, use the old teeth. Bust it open. So we have tokens. Really cool. Uh, we've got the high ground and we've got the locations. We've got the Ray character. So she's at a four, so she's similar to Luke Skywalker. Um, so the two locations we've got are Snoke's throne room and we have Maz Kanata's palace. That is really nice artwork though, really cool. And Maz's tea posing. Uh, on top of that, we do have Ray's cards. So let's take a look at these anyway. We didn't really deep dive into the cards of the core set, but we may as well look at these. Um, add up to two cards from your discard pile to your hand for each ray card added in this way, plus two influence this round. So this must be influence, this four here, like a overall prowess. Uh, the galaxy may need a legend. Search your action deck and add any card to your hand. Remove all minus ones from that card's character. Mission. Score from hand if you score the highest point value location while Ray is there. So that still doesn't mean anything right now, but I am going to learn how to play this game very, very soon. And I will be putting a, putting a video up as well, so stay tuned for that if you are liking these, uh, these Star Wars Rivals videos. Um, you underestimate me, it will be your downfall if there are no allies at Ray's location, whereas plus seven. Wow. I mean, I don't know the rules, but that seems pretty beast already. Damn. Okay. And then we've got a Rebel Trooper. So again, you get a cannon fodder character for each of these little sets as well. So that is the uh, the light side pack. Let's see who we get for the dark side. Now, if we get Snoke, that's just going to be funny. So uh, who are we thinking? I mean, I'm not going to lie. I would like Boba Fett. Um, Boba Fett or Count Dooku are my uh, my pulls. That's what we want. I mean, if we get a holograph, imagine first first box pull a holograph. Let's have a look. So, oh, we've got Count Dooku. Oh, that is awesome. Yes. That artwork's awesome. I like it. Right, let's open it up. Oh, I'm so happy. I am so... You know what, guys? Sorry, I'm just biting into this with my teeth. I can see this becoming a new addiction. And uh, the price point for these, by the way, is only 4 99 in the UK. So for £5, for £10, you can get two boxes, smash them together, and you're ready to play. So again, we have the tokens, which is cool. We're going to have an abundance of tokens. Um, we'll take a look at Dooku. Five. Okay, interesting. More than a Sars Ventress, just a little bit short of Darth Vader. So there's Dooku. Uh, we have the Galactic Senate Chamber as the location. Geonosis Execution Area. Oh, look at the artwork of that reek. That is so cool. So, so cool. I like it. Uh, right, let's have a look at Dooku's cards then. Uh, you're impossibly outnumbered. Count Dooku and all allies at the same location have plus two influences round. That's interesting. Uh, you may discard a card from your hand to draw up to two action cards. Uh, next, we have you disappoint me. Surely you can do better. Nice. Uh, you may move an ally to the back to tank. Don't know what the back to. I mean the back to tank heals, but I didn't know there was a like a, a refresh area. If you do, double Count Dooku's influence, so he would be a beefy ten. Very nice. Uh, next, 
Twice the pride, double the fall. Nice, says that to Anakin. Play another action card. You may take its action twice. Mission is score from hand if you score two locations this round. Nice. And then we've got the Imperial Trooper. So yeah, that is the expansion packs. Okay, so let's take a look at the Ray figure. So, there it is. Shall we, uh, are we going to focus? There we go. Right, you know what? I'm going to bust it open. Just uh, bail me a sec, guys. Going to the Old Faithful again. So we've got a figure. And, oh, this is different. So instead of having um, an, a weird prism dice like in the base game, you actually just get a D6 with, uh, with various numbers on. That's pretty cool. And there is the Ray figure, of course. If it'll uh, let me zoom with with derpy eyes included as well. There we go. There, oh lord, there we go. Right, we zoomed in. Okay, cool. So there's Ray. Uh, we also need to uh, take a look. Let me grab him. There we go. Ah, uh, the uh, the Count Dooku figure. There it is. Right, again, bust it open. Ugh. Let's have a look. So we've got the dice. We've seen that. Uh, focus, please. There we go. He's got his little lightsaber up. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. I like it. Very, very good. Very, very good. Nice. I'm going to play a few rounds. I'm going to learn how to... Well, I'm going to learn how to play it first. Then I'll do some dummy rounds. And then I will record a video of the setup. How to play. And if this goes well... I can see myself buying some more booster boxes, but um, yeah, what do you think guys? What do you think? Are we uh, are we interested in this game? Are you going to be getting it yourself? The price point's really low, so it's, you know, it's not that much of a risk. But anyway, until the next video guys, thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you uh, hope you enjoyed this. I'm, I'm going to be having fun with this game, and I'll, uh, I'll catch you in the next video.